Okade. Your mother sent me to find you. By Iset, is that you, by Ekosiwa? Let me out and I'll help you kill those Roman vultures. Your time will come, dog! Tibiabe! Tibi Manere! Kill it! Do not expose yourself, honey! For Siwa! I will not die like this! Nothing gets past. Usually right about these things. No surprises. Can't see anything. The farm you came from. I saw what Flavius did. How he sucked the life from our people. My mother Nenet. Is she all right? Yes. Praxila took her to Balagre. Thank you, Bayek. You protect us even this far from the land of our ancestors. Why did the Romans bring you here? To feed their hunger for war and conquest. They have Ballista. We load it with a substance of hideous, burning devastation. Vitruvios, a Roman engineer up at the aqueduct, invented it. Vitruvios? I know this man. I cannot believe you would make something like this. We are free of those Roman tyrants. Vitruvius! Vit What's the fuss, my friend? I believed you when you said you cared for the C1 here. And all the while they are more at the Citadel, forced to work on a weapon you created. It is not what you think. Walk with me, and we'll get to the bottom of this. Please understand, Bayek, I was not always so focused on architectural wonders such as this aqueduct. As a hot-headed youth, I came up with many means of death and destruction. One of those was a Greek fire of sorts. Greek fire? A substance with such potential for unspeakable suffering, I vowed never to produce it. Well, the general is producing it, and forcing C1 to arm his ballista for a war against their own country. should have burned my notes. General Agrippa must have found them. Then Agrippa must be stopped. Do what your conscience dictates, Bayek. But understand, I cannot be part of a plot against a Roman general, no matter how I may feel personally. Recover the formula and I will destroy it. I will not have the immolation of Egypt on my conscience. Jove protect you, Bayek. All who 
ally with monsters and demons will die in general. They use the formula. I should destroy the Greek fire stockpiles. Vitruvius will want to know his formula is in safer hands. Bayek, did you find it? Did you find my formula? Egypt will not burn today. Or any day, I hope. And General Agrippa? He did not give it up willingly. Ah, uh, he was a good Roman. But he never understood that doesn't mean you cannot be a good man. Flavius fed Agrippa's pride and ambition with talk of empires. I fear the path his supporters have taken will end in many deaths. It will end with their own. But you are a good man, Vitruvius. I've seen that in your words and deeds. I am trying to be. Thank you again, Bayek of Siwa. You are a true protector of your people. Just as the praying man said. A man is coming. This he farm is was armed. torched as if by Ra himself. Do? I am Bayek, a Medjai. A real Medjai. Not a Philakitai, I hope. <laughs> I'm Zahra. This was my farm. Who burned it down? Hordes. The naked Iadets trying to drive us out. They are lucky I wasn't here. I would have spread their guts across my fields. I am going to warn my Greek neighbor. His farm might be next. Please join me. I will follow you, Zahra. We have to protect this land. Yes. It is rich and fertile and worth fighting over. Like me. This farm isn't far from here. See if you can keep up, Magi. What brings you to the Fayum? We get few visitors this way. Magi is special. I am... hunting murderers. You came to the right place. Full of dogs worth killing. The Fayum is not the oasis it once was. How long have your farms been getting burned? Since the dawn of the new Ptolemy. Most of the farmers, they could not fight back and got pushed out. My family was amongst those who fought. The struggle became our way of life. I fought so much I forgot to fall in love. I am a romantic girl. My father wanted me to marry and give him lots of grandchildren. Gods! Me with a bunch of screaming kids? Our land needed protection, so I learned to fight. Egypt needs fighters. It was a good decision. Turns out I am apt at shit kicking. A warrior farmer. I do not suppose your Greek neighbor is harboring these fire bandits. That would make things simpler. But no, those are definitely uninvited guests. Keep a safe distance. I'm going to... <laughs> Nick, no. You are not. You keep a safe distance. I will be amidst the blood splatter. <laughs> a farmer warrior with a duat wish. Fine. Let us dance together. Hey! I don't think so. The bindings were so tight I can't... You're heavier than you look. Maybe you would like me to carry him. <laughs> huh? 
Zahra, that was frightening. Nek! Beyond, we cannot live scared. You must fight back. You truly are a gift from the god, Zahra. I tell all my Greek friends of Zahra, the warrior farmer. We need to find the bandit's nest. I might know where it is. Servants track riders coming south from the White Desert. There is nothing out that way except some ruins. And they mention the name Son of Ra. I think he is their leader. Son of Ra? He will soon be the son of nothing. Into the desert we go, Bayek. Bayek, we need to get moving. It's a long damned way. Okay, let's get there. Gods, by Anubis, I love the desert. It awes me, it always has. I cried like a little girl the first time I came here. I didn't know why. My father told me I was being silly. The desert brings out different sides to us. Yes, it gets cold at night. A fighter like you must have a few farmers interested. Have you never wanted a family of your own? You do not have anyone in mind? I fight too much. Well, maybe a Magi warrior could change that. <laughs> That's an invitation. Whoa. This was not their leader. The son of Ra, the real leader, has been giving orders from prison. He's being held by soldiers at a nearby caravansarai. He has been ordering the burnings. He thinks he's a god and invincible. Then we'll make the neck ear that bleed and prove him wrong. The bandits believe the son of Ra is a god? How did he convince them of that? Ra's son? That's insane. And it's creepy. I have seen it before. Oh. If you want to believe in something badly enough, you will believe anything. And do anything. Whoa. Ah. I saw the beast with my own eyes. Oh. Zahra, do not argue with me about this. I have to do this next task alone. Stop saying that camel shit. I'm not waiting around while you do the fighting. Look, it is cleaner this way. It'll be easier for me to get in alone. All right. Have it your way. I'll be nearby. That crazy is not... A Die easily for a god! I am nobody. Nobody. 
But when the son of Ra stands on the mountain and says, do it, it gets done. Next, you told them to murder. I am not sorry. Is Bayak Astiwa sorry? I lost my family. You lost your family. We have the right to do anything we want to anyone. No! We are different. You burnt farms. You killed innocents. You're insane! Hypocrite! Yeah! You can pile up 1,000 dead bodies in front of me. It doesn't change me. The world will burn. The Order won't save it. You will burn with it, Magi. May you walk the land of the Duat. He is dead. I should tell Zahra. Son of Ra is dead. It was disturbing. His madness almost made sense. If you stare deeply enough into any madness, there is a logic. So what now? The fires are stopped. Your farms are safe. I don't know. I am hungry, though. Now we return to the farm to feast in peace. Is that an invitation? <laughs> you are the Magi. You figure it out. My gate is open and my fruit is sweet. I saw the beast with my own eyes. Everyone is gone. The monsters took them while we farmed. Gods, save us! What happened to you? We were all attacked by demons. They took the boy. What boy? Why didn't anyone stop them? I tried. I am just a farmer, no warrior. The boy was mad. He thought he could fight the demons. He is just a boy at the Broken Tower. I ran away. I, I am... <laughs> A ruined tower? I cannot leave the boy alone in the desert. I must find him. This must be the ruined tower the madman spoke about. But all of his story was insanity then. What are you doing out here alone? My business is my own. Why is a protector coming here? There are rumors of disappearing villagers, demons, and a missing boy. Our village did not disappear. We were taken by bandits. I am the only one left. But I am going back to save my father. If you go into the desert alone, you will die. Then I die. I can do nothing else. You are brave, but foolish. A son's duty to his father is to live. I cannot let you go alone. Come if you want to. My duty is to save my father. You are just a boy, but you have the conviction of a man. Your father would be proud. We have to hurry. Yes, first. Follow me. Your father! Are you certain he lives? No, but I have to try. My mother passed many floods ago. I do not remember her. My father raised me alone. I have to return his horse to him. Alive or dead, he will need it in the afterlife. Sandstorm! You must face it straight on! I don't have the time to wait. If he lives, I will save him. If he does not, I will honor him with my death. And we will ride through the field of reeds together. Oh. <laughs> 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 
Boy, you must stay here. The way forward is dangerous. I will do everything in my power to rescue your father. Saving my father is my duty, not yours. I am not a boy. I am Rahotep of Dionysius. And I am going. I am Bayek of Siwa, and I will not take you into danger. You are not taking me. I am taking myself. Ah, damn you, Rahotep. Should have tied you to a tree. You have only just met me, yet I have answered all your questions truthfully. I am going to save my father. You have no duty here. You cannot forbid me anything. I am not your son. You are not the only one with a duty. I am a Magi, and my duty is to protect. Magi? There are none of you left. Just Philakes who sack our villages and kill our mothers. Protectors are corrupt. We need new Magi. New protectors. We need people and Magi to be as one, Rahote. I don't see it. Is the goddess the answer? Cleopatra? I cannot say for certain. But someone has to do what the Magi did. Honor and Egypt are both dying. I will have children and teach them, so that honor will live on in them. Stay low. We're near the bandit camp. Their guards can see us. Rahotep, my son was like you. He also fought a man's battle, and died doing it. Would you stay hidden? All right, Bayek. I will listen to you in this. But if you fall, I will take your place. See the lookout tower there? The guards from time to time abandon their post to piss. We can pass through then. You have an eye for strategy. Your father should be proud. Now keep to the shadows and wait. We need to leave this area. Quickly, this way. They left horses over here. Hurry, let's go! Rahotep! You are alive! Is everyone okay? Where is my father? Rahotep, I'm sorry. The demons took him to the crocodile pit. How can anyone fight them? Demons do not bleed as these do. Listen to me. Each of you owes your life to my father. Turo! Remember he took a lashing to protect your daughter's honor. And you! Remember he crossed the desert to get your sick father a healer. Now my father needs you. If he lives, we save him. If not, we avenge him. Either way, we fight. <laughs> Truly, you are your father's son. You are right, Rahatep. Demons or not, we will follow you. We have been ready since the day the demon bandits attacked. We ride to save my father! And may a moon ride with us! Here! You have my... Who is there? What is happening? No more! Please! Who are you? Why are you here? A friend. Can you walk? We need to get you out of here. I don't think so. I can't see. They tortured and blinded me. There is a dock outside of the camp that is safe.
Father, you live. What's wrong? The demons have taken my eyes, but they could not take my son. You saved me, Ryatep. He saved us all. He slew five of the demons alone. I saw it. Rahotep, you are a man today. You have earned your horse. I can no longer lead. You must lead us now. Father, Bayek of Siwa is also here. He fought with us. You will always be honored at our village. We will make a feast tonight. Will you join us? Your son is brave. I'm glad to have helped him. Though I doubt he will need help in the future, he will lead you well. Now, I must go to hunt my own demons. Thank you for rescuing us. Oh, this is my fault. By Anubis, I swear. I just wanted them to dream a little. If only I had not told them those stories. Enough, Sedney. Children will be children. Let's just find them. That is why I am here. Any idea where they went? The ancient temple of Alexander the Great, maybe. That is the one I was telling them about. It is northwest of here. It's been a while. They might have gone west to Theos Elpis Rift. We have a camp there. Very well. I will scour the temple area. You head for the camp. I'll go with you. Sebni will go back to the chasm camp, where it is safer for dreamers to be. <laughs> the children used to run free here, but ever since the Pharaoh's guards arrived... What was once a playground is now a death ground. Yes. The Pharaoh's men are snakes, coiled in the sand beneath our feet. They kill adults and children alike. Ah, uh, the desert is meant for all souls, hunters and poets, not the slaughter of innocents. You know this place well. I grew up here. I love it. But the Pharaoh's men spoil everything they touch. Tell me about the children. Etanu is a good student. He'll be a scholar one day. Estella, I'm training her. She's always protecting her friend. Strong, a good little warrior. Do you train all the children to become rebels? They are free to choose as they please. But they all hate the Pharaoh's men. <laughs> ah, people will blame Estella for this. What do you mean? She is loud and outspoken. He has the adventurous heart. Estella protects. People just don't listen. They are loyal to each other. They are good children. Split up. We should be able to find traces of their presence faster that way. These ostraka are similar to those used by the children Nawa was teaching. They must have dropped it here. Notes on Alexander the Great and the temple. And many wild theories as to what treasures might be here.
Keep still and try to stay quiet. The hidden entrance. It must lead inside the temple. The entrance is barred. I will have to find another way inside. Something of importance was here. I wonder who took it. I told Estella to take the shield so she could get out. But the spear was too heavy for us. I cannot wait until we get back. We really did find Alexander's treasure. I am Hetanu. Thank you, Weneb, for rescuing me. I am no lord. You may call me Bayek. Now, tell me what happened to your child. We came looking for the legendary treasure of Alexander the Great. Our teacher told us all about him, and we knew there had to be more. We managed to get into the temple. But then the snakes came out of the water and surrounded us. What about Estella? She did not want to leave me, but I told her to go and get help. She used the shield for protection. Not a single snake touched her. But that was hours ago, and I am worried. She should have been back with help by now. If she is not with you, something must have happened to her. Let's get you out of here fast. Follow me. I trust you have learned your lesson. I know. If not for Bayek, those snakes would have eaten me whole. Well, perhaps not whole, but it would have been a dire fate nonetheless. Now, did Estella say where she was going? She went to the chasm camp to find help. I will go look for the little warrior. Smoke. It is coming from the camp. Once again, you have come to our rescue. We will forever be in your debt at this rate. Hetanu is safe. Hamid is with him. Oh, thank the gods. I wish I could say the same for Estella. Their leader, Medon, took her as she arrived. He wanted the great shield she was carrying, and when she refused to give it to him, he snatched her up. He kept asking her if there was more treasure. Pisa Oros. That is where he probably took her. No one ever comes back from there. Please, you must go find her. Medon will torture her to get what he wants. I will find her, and I will take care of Medon. The Citadel is in the Southwest Mountains. Medon patrols between here and the Citadel. Just look for an angry bald man surrounded by bodyguards. Hi, 
pleasure for me, She was Everyone talks on the speed of the ice. Must get clear! Stop the pursuit! Sit! The Arconda is down! Lock the road behind me! I will get through! This should offer some measure of respite to the rebels. Now to find the citadel and save the child. Brave warrior, that was a chariot ride worthy of Set himself. Did the rebel send you? Those men were going to kill me. You show much fire for one your age. You were too in my place. The Pharaoh's dogs seek to wipe us out and control everything. They do not understand. Life must flow freely or else everything rots. They wanted my treasure, so I fought back. Besides, I had to protect Hitanu. If they had found him, they would have killed him. I have been so worried. Your friend is safe. He's back at the camp with the others. Where you should be as well. I know, I know. Be more careful, Estella. Stay out of trouble, Estella. One day, though. One day, I'll be just like you. I will liberate the desert so we can all be free. On that day, come find me, young warrior. It will be an honor to fight by your side. Ah, Yekovs, you are. What are you of now? <laughs> I wonder myself. Recently, I fought a giant snake the size of the pyramids with my bare hands. That is impossible. Where was the snake? I ate his butter story. Or a dream. I do not know the difference anymore. <laughs> you see, my seni. It is best to tell the story, not the truth. <laughs> you know, I have heard stories of you in my travels. You should be proud of your ways. They God smile on your deeds. I love all those I meet. Families, outcasts, lost gods and goddesses, desert rats, ruffians. And I will mourn the day when I cannot defend them anymore. I always wanted joy. But I worry my marriage to darkness will win. Your sojourn on Earth should not trouble you. The joy in your heart forever walks beside you. Your place in the field of reeds will be splendid, Reda. And you will need to be prepared as always. What would you like today? I'm no actor, Simonides. And Bayak, my friend. We were just talking about you. Ah, should I be worried? No, no. Simonides wants me to play myself in a comedy he's written about Leander. The laudable triumph of the luminaries of Cyrene. Ah, catchy title. He'd be the first to admit it's drivel. But we're hoping a festival will restore some goodwill. To that end, I have one last favor to ask. No acting required. <laughs> Leander's villa should return back to the people. But without the deed, that's impossible. The Romans won't let us search Leander's office at the Acropolis. They will let me. I will find it. Where better to find the deed but hidden quarters? The villa papers. Diocles will be happy. He can usher in a new era now.
The deed is yours, Diocles. The people had lost faith in us magistrates. This will restore a lot of it. You will win hearts and minds, Diocles, with actions. Vitruvius is a friend of yours, yes? A visiting merchant said he saw him on the road near the citadel, and he appeared to be in trouble. That architect is a good man. I've heard his public works have revitalized South Sarinega. I would love to meet him in person. Perhaps we can meet at the Oracle of Apollo. I will check on Vitruvius, that rare Roman dreamer. Vitruvius! Diocles told me you were attacked. On my way to the Citadel, some accursed marauders took my manuscript, my life's work, the architecture. These are dangerous times, but I would not take bandits for scholars. I dread to think what they'll do with it. Certainly not appreciate the function and form of the modern approach to architecture. Then I will get it back before they use it for kindling, or worse. Vitruvius's book, saved for posterity. Knowledge in the wrong hands is a sad waste. You found it! Praise Jupiter! They were sad to lose it. <laughs> I'm sure they had already started using it to improve their rat trap. Thank you, my friend. I will dedicate a chapter to you. I am honored. Actually, my friend Diocles is very interested in reading it. I said we would meet him at the Oracle Shrine. A capital idea. I have someone I need to see, and I will join you. I should go and see Praxila, because she should be at this meeting of the great minds of Cyrene. Bayek! I did not think I would see you again, but I heard Flavius is no more. It was a day I had long wished for. But how has it been in Balagre? The Romans are cooperating more now that Melita is gone. <clears throat> we will see about that. And your friend, Krios? I am teaching him the healing arts. But I sent him out a day ago to the East Hills to gather herbs, and he has not returned. I was just about to go look for him. I will find him if you will go to the Oracle Shrine. There's a friend there that would like to see you. Is it? No, I will not dare to hope. I will join you when I find Krios. I thought you were a dream. You are a friend of Praxilas. You are making a habit of getting into trouble. <laughs> yes. The plan reveals what is in the seed. I will take more care in future. Oh, thank you, Protector. Maniac and Taras. Yes, yes, do you please, I You have brought us all together, Bayek. Cyrene's triumvirate heralds of a new peace for this outpost of Rome. Each thinks his own horizon is the limit of the world, but through you we have found a greater purpose. And Braxila and I are to be married. <laughs> Theocles, I have not said yes yet. If you have a garden and a library, you have everything you need. But now a toast. To Bayek and Cyrene. To peace and order. To love and weddings. Vade and pace, Sarenaeca.
So you will come back to Balagre with me? If that is where you want to build our home. You could do a lot of good there. Huh? mother and I many grandchildren. I'll have to find a wife then. You are young, my son. There's no reason to rush. I won't rush. That is the last one. I can take all the shards back to Siwa now. I'm going to find every stone circle, the Sphinx and Pyramid that wind. and I'll find my place. Sandstorm coming. My son. Name Hemu means Egypt. Like Egypt, you are forever changed. The stars are yours now, and your place is with them. <laughs> 